pandemic, obviously the focus was on patient safety, personal safety, and population safety. Now we're at a point, not that the pandemic is over, but that things are more controlled. So now that we're starting to return to normal, what's important for patients to know is to get, it's time to get back out there, seeing their physicians, following up on their healthcare conditions that they're currently being treated for, and um, seeing their physicians to talk about risk factors that they have to prevent disease in the future. Heart disease is the number one killer of men and women in this country and worldwide, even in the face of the pandemic. So what's important to know is your individual risk factors. You can go to ssmhealth.com slash heart to do a heart uh, health assessment. That's one way of doing it. The other way is seeing your physician and talking to them, your slew care cardiologist or primary care doctor about your individual risk factors, which can include high blood pressure, high cholesterol, diabetes, family history. And those are all things that we can discuss and work towards maintaining or preventing. We look a lot at symptoms of heart disease of people who are having chest discomfort with activity, people who are having decrease in their exercise tolerance, meaning you're getting more fatigued earlier or more short of breath earlier. Those can be signs and symptoms of the COVID-20 that some people have, but it could be a sign of a more insidious or ongoing heart process. So if you're having any of those symptoms, it's important to talk to your doctor about that. It's definitely understandable to be nervous getting back out there, getting into a social environment, even if the social environment is just a doctor's visit, but all uh, clinics at SLU Care are uh, following CDC precautions, meaning hand hygiene, mask wearing, social distancing, and limiting the number of people uh, that you're gonna come in contact with.